Hey everyone, it's Dust Time, and this time around this Jazz Jacker of episode 5, part 1. Now, um, just like with episode 4, I had a little bit of trouble at the beginning, but I only played like the first level before I realized I had changed my sound settings. I wish there was a, like, unfortunately also, I can't, wow, this started off well. This level is pretty darn tough just from everything I've done with it so far. Like, I beat this first level, and I did find the secret. Which was completely by accident, actually, because I did not expect the secret level to be located in the first level of the episode, but, um, I did find it. Uh, anyway, the, um... There's a lot of missiles and stuff you get here. Um... Yeah, I uh, had changed my sound settings to do another video blog, and then even with that, when I unplugged my one mic, instead of resetting to my normal mic, it reset it to the new webcams mic, which, uh, not a very good thing. I mean, it's an okay mic, don't get me wrong, considering if that was it, I guess I could use that, but it's not a very good mic. And, uh, anyway. Sound issues fixed and good and you should be able to hear everything as I play Jazz Jack Rip episode 5 and get through this this level like I said was a pain the first time I went through it a huge pain because stuff like this this like non-stop slaughter of your of your rabbit children here cool thing was getting the bird and I really like this part you know we've seen it in other games but hadn't seen it yet in this game. There we go. We have to destroy a piece of the column and then you can go through. This is of course one of the rabbit's home planets. I guess that's probably what this whole um, thing will be about. Because you can see that uh, there's a lot of the rabbit statues and rabbit stuff and all that good fun stuff everywhere in this level. fall down here, if I can fall down. Over here is an extra life. And then over to the right is where we want to go. Which is the end of the levels right there. But down here is the entrance to the secret level. So there we go. I know I did a lot better this time, of course, doing that level, but that's because I did it once already, but I had I did not complete the secret level. I double checked my uh, all my settings, and I want to make sure that this is going the way I want. Yeah, there we go. Of course, I jump in the only thing that can hurt you and lose my bird. It's like the only thing in the whole level that can hurt you is that, and I end up jumping into it. But thankfully, you do get another bird. Rapid fire. And collect a bunch of the disc if I want. And there's the end of the level. Now, this level I did not complete yet, so, and of course I lose my bird right at the start of the level. Just what I wanted to do, actually. I swear that said dick right there. It says Nick, but I thought it said dick. Ignore me. <laughs> What's that? Oh god, there's a lot of guys. Of 
course. Ah, there we go. That's exactly what I want. And I get shot in the butt <laughs> by one of the lasers. God, another one. They don't stop here. Wow, really? Like, I don't... Why can they... It's not, like, fair at all. They can kind of, like, just barely shoot over a platform that you're standing on. It's like, that's really obnoxious, actually. Just makes these guys even more, worse to deal with than they already were. Of course, I keep running into dragons. I think they're dragons. Not positive. No, there's probably going to be more guys here. Not, not surprisingly. What was this? Oh! That's actually cool. What was this? Oh! Awesome! You know what that means? Run for your life! <laughs> you have any of this? You run through any object and enemy you can for a little bit. Especially all the really tough enemies that you have to deal with in this. That definitely helped out a little bit. I do not, okay, I did not realize the trees spit at you like that. I don't know how I didn't. I guess I just didn't get hit by it the first time around. Oh, wow. Okay. Go back down here. What was over here? Oh, okay, a bunch of, uh, that. Make sure I grab them all. That would be helpful, actually. Run! Once again, never stop running. Ah. Of course I run out of it and run right into an enemy. How many shots did that guy take? I hate enemies, like, um, it's always annoying when your bullets don't go off screen and attack a guy, but their bullets can travel from, like, all the way across the level and still somehow end up running into you. Okay. Now up here was that tree that got me last time. Of course, and then it's him that gets me. I have like no health, and I got another lava pit thing to jump over. Come on, come down here. There we go. I'm waiting for that guy to turn around before I attempt to fall down here. There we go. Oh, awesome. Health. Desperately needed health. <laughs> down here. Anything? Oh, the exit. Okay. Time for the second planet. Slugion? What the heck was that? What the heck is that? I'm out of fire. I don't like the launch thingies as much. So watch what they give me now. <laughs> Little turtle, so this must be a turtle planet. Or back to a turtle planet. 
Can you actually land on me? No. Okay, then what? Ah, oh, okay, there was a thing I was supposed to kind of wait for. Can they give you enough of these things? I got 100, 231 bouncing ammo now, but there's a bat enemy. They really needed to add a bat enemy, the Jazz Jackrabbit. The game's hard enough as is. Now they add a, a bat enemy to deal with. Get that bat. Go down here? Yes. Okay, well I can get up. Okay, good. Oh, God, a bat. The turtles are fine, they don't hurt you. But that Batman? That <laughs> Batman. Okay, we'll head down this way. Oh, more health. Of course, when I have full health, you find more health. What the? Atomic slime. Slug. I guess that's why it's sluggy on. There's slugs. Get it? I don't know. Ah, and they can go into the background behind columns that get in your way. So those are fun. Up here. Oh, that's the end of the level. Fantastic. I'll take that. Sluggy on. Save right here. Anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap up this edition of DOS Time. I'd like to thank you for watching, and of course, I hope you enjoyed.